The Ono State Government agreed to return four schools to the original owners, and a committee set up by the state government is visiting the schools to be returned to their owners. The committee is led by Commissioner for Education, Science and Technology, Mr. Femi Agagu, but the Muslim community at a press conference in Akure urged Governor Olorotimi Akredolu not to return schools to the missionaries. The Chairman League of Imams and Alphas, Sheikh Ahmad Aladeshawe, represented by the Secretary of the League and Chief Imam of Shukari Akoko Al Haji Abdul Rashid Akrile alleged that the steps were aimed at giving public property to empower some individuals. It is a call to hand over public properties to individuals in the name of faith based organization. It is a call to return to the dark to the dark era in the issue of educational development in our nation. It will result in more children being thrown out of schools. It is a call to deny the children of the impoverished in, in, in masses access to affordable and qualitative education in an atmosphere of religious freedom devoid of bigotry. The cleric who frowned at returning public schools to the faith-based organizations alleged that such action would deny Muslim children access to such schools. The community of Fundo State is rejecting the idea of return of schools to its Education is the strongest tool of empowerment and development. It is a major factor which distinguishes man from other animals, and it is a yardstick to measure the level of uh, development of a country and also to forecast its prospects. In fact, it is said that no nation will develop above the level of its education. The cleric said the Muslim community will seek legal action if the state government fails to rescind the decision. Mulea Rio, OSS News.